Why is the EA-18G Growler more crucial than you think? Engaging an aircraft carrier based air combat without electronic warfare and jamming of enemy air defenses is simply not possible. This is where the US Navy's EA-18G Growler plays a crucial role. This aircraft ensures the safety of follow-on attack aircraft by creating a secure path, allowing them to avoid enemy radar and surface-to-air missiles. It's a proven fact in warfare, as it's a modified version of the FA-18F Super Hornet, created to take over from the EA-6B Prowler. The Growler is the first electronic warfare aircraft to be newly designed in over 35 years. Moreover, it maintains all the versatile capabilities of the FA-18EF with its approved design and the ability to carry out various missions for enemy defense suppression. With its pair of General Electric F414 GE 400 turbofan engines, the EA-18G Growler boasts an impressive 44,000 pounds of thrust. This allows the aircraft to reach a maximum speed of 1,960 kilometers an hour, or MH 1.6, and travel up to 1,570 kilometers with external fuel tanks. It can be challenging to adapt to something new, the Navy is currently grappling with the major challenge of getting accustomed to the advanced features of the aircraft. Take for example, the EA-18G Growler and the 6B Prowler. The main distinction lies in the fact that the Growler integrates electronic warfare with a weapon system. Moreover, the technological interface is predominantly fresh and unfamiliar. Overcoming these hurdles is no easy task particularly due to the scarcity of pilots who possess expertise in flying both electronic attack aircraft and fighter mission aircraft. The Prowler lacked a weapon system, making it vulnerable and requiring a fighter escort for every mission. However, the Growler is equipped with air-to-air -air defense mechanisms, allowing it to directly engage enemy forces. In surveillance, only setups, it carries two AIM-120 missiles for self-defense. For jamming operations, it is armed with two AGM-88 and two AIM-120s. And for strike missions, it mounts two AGM-88, two AIM-120s, and two AGM-154 joint standoff weapons. The EA-18G was a collaborative effort between Boeing and Northrop Grumman. Boeing handled the wings, forward fuselage, and final assembly, while Northrop Grumman took charge of the rear fuselage, aircraft body, and the complete electronic system. The EA-18G boasts cutting-edge technology, ensuring seamless communication between the aircraft and the aircrew. The EA-18G is an aircraft designed for carrier operations. It is widely recognized as the top-notch aircraft when it comes to technical jamming and electronic protection. Its inaugural test flight took place in October 2006, just two years after production commenced. Since 2014, more than 1,000 EA-18Gs have been manufactured, and there are ongoing plans to keep producing them. Other nations have shown interest in this innovative device. Specifically, Australia, the vast island nation, acquired a dozen of these aircraft in 2013 and the initial delivery to their country took place in 2015. Moreover, it marks a significant milestone as it is the first instance where such advanced intelligence has been developed and sold to another country this cutting-edge technology will undoubtedly leave the enemy bewildered and unaware. The EA-16G Growler specializes in two main tasks, electronic attack and the suppression of enemy air defenses. To carry out these missions effectively, Growlers are equipped with a range of advanced electronic warfare systems. In the first version, Block 1 Growlers are fitted with up to three ALQ-99 radar jamming pods, an ALQ-218 receiver, and a Raytheon 
ALQ-227 Communication Countermeasure System. These systems are typically mounted in the FA-18's gun bed. On the other hand, Block 2 Growlers are equipped with an APG-79 Active Electronically Scanned Array Radar that has both passive detection mode and active radar suppression capabilities. Additionally, they have an ALQ-218 Digital Radar Warning Receiver and an ALA-47 Countermeasures Dispenser. The EA-18G Growler systems enable it to offer support and safeguard to friendly forces on land, in the sky, and at sea. It achieves this by disrupting enemy radar and offering electronic protection. Moreover, the Growler can share electronic intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance data with other friendly aircraft. It also excels in maintaining seamless radio communications, even in heavily jammed environments, thanks to its interference cancellation system. The ALQ-227 communications countermeasure set on the Growler enables the EA-18G to digitally disrupt enemy communications across a wide range of frequencies. Additionally, it has the capability to identify, capture, and replay those communications. The Growler is a master at gathering and analyzing data, it not only excels at swiftly infiltrating air defenses, but it also possesses the ability to pinpoint enemy communication sources, disrupt them, and capture valuable information. This data is then shared with other aircraft, like the E-2 Hawkeye, which play a crucial role in early warning operations. By leveraging this intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance analytics, the Growler contributes significantly to enhancing our understanding of the battlefield. Additionally, it diligently safeguards friendly communication from falling into the wrong hand. Defense contractors are constantly seeking ways to enhance their capabilities. They are committed to making continuous improvements. Boeing has recently announced a five-year Growler modification program that will significantly enhance data collection capabilities. This upgrade will greatly strengthen the EA-18G's ability to share information with other aircraft. Moreover, the processing of ISR data will be greatly improved. In addition, Raytheon is working on providing the Growler with the next-generation jammer which will extend its range for electronic warfare activities and enable it to engage multiple targets simultaneously. As the Growler is built on a versatile platform, it will continue to evolve and improve over time. The Growler is receiving a major boost from the Department of Defense. In a recent announcement, the Navy revealed its plans to enhance the sensor hardware and software of the EA-18G Growler through a contract modification worth $71.4 million. Not only that, but the Air Force is also keen on having its own growler, and this idea has gained approval from Congress. The Department of Defense is so impressed with the growler that it is extending its capabilities to the Air Force. It's high time that the Air Force had access to this remarkable asset as well. Thanks to the Fiscal Year 2022 National Defense Authorization Act, funds have been allocated to equip existing Air Force fighters with the next-generation jammer. Currently, the Air Force lacks its own version of the Growler, but this will soon change. The EA-18G Growler is a highly versatile electronic warfare aircraft that plays multiple roles within a carrier battle group. One of its key functions is gathering intelligence through patrols. In times of potential conflict, it ensures the safety of attack aircraft like the Super Hornet by creating secure paths. Additionally, it effectively communicates with the E-2 Hawkeye to intercept and monitor enemy communications. In East Asia, it stands as the top choice for aerial battles. In the 21 first century, electronic warfare and the suppression of enemy air defenses are crucial. The Navy is fortunate to have the EA-18G Growler, which not only disrupts enemy radar and weapon systems, but also collects valuable communication data. This unique capability, combined with future modifications and upgrades, will further enhance its performance.